What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to the show. Make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe, follow that Twitter and Instagram right down below. Today, we're going to be talking about compound movements. That's right. In lifting, everybody starts out with one thing, right? And I do believe that if you're, let's say me, I'm five foot nine, five feet, nine inches. I was about 110 pounds or 115, 117 pounds when I started lifting. And I don't think that I should have been walking in worrying about my bicep. And I think a lot of people are doing that. And that's not the right thing to do. When you're working out for the first time ever, I think you should be doing these five workouts. Bent over rows for back, benching for chest, squatting for legs, deadlifting for lower back, and shoulder pressing for shoulders. And deadlifting, you could also say, works out your glutes and hamstrings. But what do all those have in common? A barbell. Just get a barbell. Go to the gym, go to the barbell section, and just shoulder press till you can't anymore. Bench till you can't anymore. Worry, you, I think you do have to worry about numbers. You worry about sculpting your body and losing a little bit of fat and making your right bicep a little bigger than your left because it's lacking. You worry about that stuff when you're like two, three years down the line, when you've perfected everything. But I see people who have never lifted a single day in their life. They don't bench 225 for one rep. My one rep max is 225. And, you know, you see all these people, they go in and they get a 225 pounders and they're doing dumbbell flies. That's not going to help you grow your chest. I'm not telling you to eat 5,000 calories like a lot of other people. I think you're just going to end up getting fat. But, um... You know, eat 2,000 calories and do those compound movements. Do those five movements. I think a lot of people disregard those now because if you go into a gym, you'd see all these machines. You see a machine that focuses on this part of your delt. Then you see another machine that focuses on this part of your chest. You know what I'm saying? The only thing you need to make gains for the rest of your life, I'm not kidding, is a barbell. Seriously. I know that sounds real stupid, but you just need a barbell. You need... Um, a bunch of bumper plates, a bunch of, uh, you know, weight plates. I don't know. And that's it. Squat your life away when you're doing legs, bench your life away when you're doing chest shoulder, press your life away when you're doing, when you're working out shoulders, keep doing that. And I guarantee you, if you're benching four Oh five, your triceps are going to get big. It's just inevitable, but let me know what you guys think. Make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.